and you can speak about this if you like as well. But yeah, no, that is true, and I have said that before in this group. Uh, you don't need, you know, if you are, um, that's a good point, um, if your personal field is below, if you've got addiction and you join a 12-step group and your personal vibration is below uh, unconditional love, then if you see what happens when you join the group is you join the group energy of the group and by by intention and by commitment you are aligned with that group like people you know people feel an affiliation to that group and then you're joined with that group and so when you think of the group you know that energy is with you and that unconditional love of that energy you're a member and so that energy is there if if you're not at the level of unconditional love which is quite advanced quite a lot of intense spiritual work and you leave the group uh, you'll relapse uh, so um, because you're let's say you're at uh, I don't know 300 or 180 or something if you're below integrity and you leave the group uh, there is no God you know I can use my willpower on alcohol so if you leave the group then you're leaving that connection to the field of unconditional love. You're leaving that, that you're leaving God's grace, and then eventually you pick up the alcohol or the donuts, whatever it is. Um, if your, I mean, if your, um, if your personal vibration is above uh, unconditional love, then you no longer need the group because your vibration is actually above that of the group. So you can leave. Um, it might, so it might be really important to still be accountable someone you know having someone in a spiritual path as you know, yeah it's all I mean that's, gen that's general I mean Hawkins said that even if you're above five above unconditional love you should still have someone or a group to do because you can always you know actually this is a world of temptation so even even the big heavy spiritual heavyweights can be pulled down uh, so yeah yeah good point